What's up guys? It's been a while since I've made a face-to-face -face video, but here I am. And I want to talk today about a new thing I've been doing, which can help you lose weight, but I use it more for the mental aspect, right? I use it more for the discipline aspect, and that's intermittent fasting. Now, basically it's a protocol where you fast for certain period of the day every day and you have an eating window where you're able to eat all your food and all your calories right and people generally use it as a way to lose weight because if you have a smaller eating window it's less likely that you're going to you know binge out and eat a bunch of food and get fat so the protocol i use is 16 hours fasted and eight hours eating window which means from 12 to 4 p.m I won't eat anything, I'll skip breakfast and then from 4 to 12 I'll be able to eat all the stuff that I need. And don't worry, this isn't going to starve you. Your body is perfectly capable of handling being in a fasted state for this long. If you think about it, only a few hundred years ago we weren't in access to all this food at all times. You can just go to your fridge and grab something to eat because fridges weren't even invented back then. So your body is definitely able to go on for long periods of time in a faster state. It's perfectly normal. And also there's proven to be health benefits, which I might link somewhere here if I can find them. So it's definitely good for you. But I use it more as a way to build willpower, right? It builds willpower because it gets you in a disciplined state. I don't eat anything until 4 p.m. No matter how hungry I am, no matter how starving I feel, if I feel like I'm gonna die, I don't give a shit, I don't eat anything until 4 p.m. So if I keep doing this on a daily basis and stick into the routine, 4 p.m., 4 p.m. is when I break the fast, I kinda get a bit of a uh, momentum going in life. See, so you're staying true to one aspect of your life, which might be your eating, and that momentum goes on to other aspects. So maybe the work that you do, or maybe your exercise regimen, you don't want to fuck up, so you want to keep the momentum going. So I believe in developing a killer work ethic, right? At the early stage. The earlier you develop this work ethic, the better. If you are working in a job that you hate, in the meantime, work the fuck out of that job. Do the best of your capabilities. Get that discipline up. Build that work ethic because Later on down the road, when you actually create something of your own, perhaps a business or perhaps you get to a job you do like, you already have that foundation laid up where you've been working your ass off and you already have that habit. So success no longer becomes something, it's just a habit, it's just automated. So that's why I am doing this to build that discipline, which then goes over to other areas of your life. And I advise you guys try it, it's really easy. It's a really primal way of testing your will. And remember, your willpower is just like a muscle. The more you use it, the bigger it gets. So just remember that. That's the quick video for today. If you liked it, make sure you like the video. If you haven't subscribed, like me subscribed. Peace.